Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. My name is Brianna Wilson. I am the founder and occupational therapist behind Freedom and Function located in Austin, Texas, where I work with adults and seniors recovering from a stroke in the comfort of their homes, helping them rediscover their independence and get back to living. So today I'm going to show you how to do one-handed shoe tying. And so let's just get started. Okay, so we're going to do some one-handed shoe tying. And so one thing that may be helpful to you during this process is something like a step stool so that you can bring your foot closer to where you can actually reach okay and so one thing that I want you to note is how my shoe is laced okay I have the last part going under and then the string going on the outside I like that better because it kind of just helps you tighten up around so what we're going to do is we're going to start with this outside lace and we're going to cross it over and then we're going to start with the inside lace and cross it over and then we're going to tuck it under so you should have a little loop okay now sometimes you see some people using their other foot to secure this down to tighten but I'm going to show you how to do that without having to use your other foot so you're gonna take your lace that's on the inside and you're gonna bring it around your ankle to the other side. And then you're gonna grab this string and you're gonna pull it over, okay? So behind and over, okay? So now it's tightened. What you're gonna do is you're gonna take this lace and you're going to tuck it in underneath all these laces here. And you should see it forms a little loop, okay? You're going to then take that string, the excess string, and you're going to loop it through that loop. Now when you pull, you're not going to pull this one. You see, this is the one that controls the end of the lace. You're going to pull the inside one. And then you're gonna use the other side to help position it because we want it in about the middle okay then you're going to take this outside lace and you're going to wrap it around the loop we just made okay and then we're going to go underneath the laces on this side okay and it's going to form a little loop here can you see that loop that it just formed this one here and then you're going to take the excess and you're gonna loop it through again. Again, we're not gonna pull this side. So as you can see, that's the one that controls this lace. We're gonna pull the inside. And then we're just gonna even out the strings. And there you go. Your shoe is tied, it's not coming off. It's good to go. If you have any questions, let me know.